Thank you. So the, listen, yes. you're like a huge TV star, but in the film there's world... There's a but? There, there's a but. Oh, I thought I could leave after right, that. No, you're done. Bye. Okay, thank you. But in the film Good world, night. you haven't done as much, right? A tiny star right. in the film okay. world. So is, is this something you had to read for, beg for, and then how did you find out that you had gotten it? Uh, well, no, there wasn't as much groveling as I, I'm used to. Um, <laughs> So I, 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 I had made a tiny, tiny movie um, called We'll Never Have Paris that I wrote and did it with my wife and directed and did all these, everything for it. And the casting director um, was named Kathleen Chopin, appropriately so. And a year later, I got uh, an email uh, from her that I thought was from a Nigerian prince because <laughs> it had Meryl Streep's name and question marks, like, would you be willing? And then Meryl Streep, and then Stephen Frears, and wow. would you consider reading this? And so I played hard, I was like, well, let me see what I can do. See if I can have time to read that script. <laughs> uh, and I went home and I just was like crying reading this. Um, and I said, did you know that I, I played the piano? I played the piano as well. I, this is like meant to be, and she didn't even know. And so I, wow. I met with Stephen Frears, who is an eccentric, and yes. It doesn't have a, a large attention span, and I, and just I think wanted this to work, uh, and didn't really know me, and wanted to know how well I could play the piano, and mm. can you act while you play the piano? Can you drink water? Can you look at your watch? Can you work with Meryl Streep? Have you met Meryl? And I just said yes, 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 <laughs> yes. Uh, all those things, Stephen. I when can, can I meet on Meryl? Horseback? Sure. Yeah. I think at one point it was like August, and he said, what are you doing December 3rd? And I was like, uh, can you come to New York to meet Meryl? And I said, yes, no, actually, I was, I was going to head out that way anyway. <laughs> so, um, yeah. So, and then, uh, and then he wanted to prove that I wasn't just a, a psychopath, so I sent in a tape. Um, but I played jazz, and I played... Uh, popular music and rock bands, and um, I wasn't uncool enough to play opera music, so I, I hadn't done that, or a classical, and I crammed, and uh, I sent him a, a tape from my iPhone, and I got the part, uh, before I ever read anything, yeah. 